I'm Isabel Hoyla with NBC Sports, live from the Winter Olympics. We'll be with Autumn, who is live from the medal ceremony. Then to ice skating champions Mila Jabari and Austin Klein. It looks like the proceeds are starting. We'll check in with our correspondent, Autumn, who is there now. Thanks, Isabel. The downhill skiing event has just ended here and our winners will surely join the greats. We are coming to you live from the Winter Olympics where they'll be handing out the medals. Let's take a look at our medalists who will take their place in Winter Olympics history. I'm surprised you didn't compete this year, Isabel. It could have been you on the podium. You think I could have gone for gold? I think bronze might be a more realistic goal for you, Isabel. Before we move on, let's give it up for the talented NBC Sports crew here at the International Broadcast Center. Woo! I'm so excited to have the chance to interview these next athletes. They just finished as this year's champions in the figure skating pairs event. To all time greats, please welcome Malaj Jabari and Austin Klein. Hello, Milad and Austin. Great to have you here. How is Olympic Village treating you? It's not as good as my house, but it'll do. <laughs> <laughs> it's actually pretty great, actually. Uh, you know, we, um, me and uh, Milad, you know, as partners, we do everything together. Uh, you know, we just practice figure skating. We went to lunch, and now we're here, so thanks for having us. So after a tight competition, you two are now Olympic gold medalists. What has the journey been like? Uh, it's just pretty normal for me, you know, do this on the regular. We, you know, we do it now, we do it on the regular, but uh, me and Milad, you know, growing up back in uh, Kansas, you know, there wasn't much ice, you know, around. So, uh, you know, the fact, <laughs> I guess it's funny, but, you know, it's actually pretty unfortunate. Um, so what we do have now is, um, you know, we have a lot, we have a lot of ice, and uh, it's great to have it here. No place like home, right? Yeah. It sounds like everything is really working out for you. It sure is. So I hear you spent a lot of time training these past four years. What is the best tip you have for your young figure skaters out there? You know, it's, uh, I think the number one tip that most people overlook is always keep your, your skates sharp. Uh, you know, if anybody's really trying to get into the field of uh, figure skating, you know, that's like the number one goal that I have. And also, you know, follow your dreams. For me, I uh, basically just practice by watching Blades of Glory. I try to do like Charles Michael Michaels. I'll have to start implementing that into my morning routine. So I heard you've been getting offers for sponsorship deals left and right. What's next for you two? Well, you know, the sponsorships are great, but uh, I'm really looking into um, opening up my next uh, new franchise. It's a clothing company. It's called the Figure Skater Bros. It's going to be opening up uh, down in uh, Times Square. Me and Milad are really, really excited and um, really excited to share it with you guys. Oh. I'm going to buy Mars. <laughs> <laughs> Well, try not to forget us little people now that you're stars. I'll try not to. You two, have, you two have been partners for a long time. How has it been working with one another? You know, sometimes being together a lot, you know, it can get really, uh, really toxic in the uh, in the environment. But me and Milad, we do a lot of uh, team building exercises, you know, in order to stay and keep that bond close to each other. He takes long showers. <laughs> like you really get along. Milad and Austin, we love having you here. What has been part of your favorite what part has been your favorite part of the game so far? Um, you know, just uh, seeing that crowd and, um, you know, making the, making the uh, people smile. You know, that's my favorite part. And the women. <laughs> I think my favorite part has been seeing you guys do your thing. We almost forgot. We snuck you, we snuck you this out from the Olympic Village. Handmade Team USA gloves. Thanks! I heard you had sticky fingers. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm glad you didn't enjoy your time here at the Can you believe we are out of time? We'll have to do this again for the next games. How does that sound? Sounds great. Gonna get gold again. So good to have you here. Thanks for dropping by. Of course. Any time for you. But next time I'd like to meet Mike Trico. <laughs> And the 
talented Milaj Javari and Austin Klein. Our wonderful camera operators, and of course, our crew in the International Broadcast Center. Thank you for tuning in. We hope you enjoy the rest of the day.